You know, this is peppermint. We're not sure why she's limping. Bridget works for Life is Better Rescue. They're very compassionate with the animals that they save, and they do what's in the animal's best interest. So we try and give them discounted rates. You can really tell she's ginger on it. Yeah. How could anyone be mean to you? She was found as a stray. She was found with a rope tied around her. Around her leg? Yes. The lower part of her leg up to her elbow feels pretty normal. Right above her elbow, it seems to be pretty hard and swollen. There's a real callus right in the middle of the humerus bone. Anytime it's this big and hard, you're kind of suspicious that there's an old fracture there. The thickness and the, and the hardness of the scar tissue tells me peppermint's been in a lot of discomfort for quite some time. This needs to be fixed. It's only going to get worse with time. We'll get her back and get an x-ray on her and find out what's going on. Great. Christine, you want to poke her for me? It's very common for us to sedate patients that have a suspected fracture. That way we don't hurt them at all and we're able to get the shot that we need. Good girl. It sounds like it's been fractured for a while, and so maybe she's been running the streets with a hurt leg for a while. Come on, Peppermint. Sleepy puppy. Hi. Right. Oh. Peppermint's x-ray does not look good. I think the problem is going to be that this is an old fracture. So we have a huge amount of scar tissue that we have to get through. And I got kind of big fingers, and these are pretty small bones, so it really is hard, especially when there's multiple pieces, get them perfectly aligned. This is a highly adoptable dog. I mean, she's really sweet. We're going to give it a shot, and hopefully we can save this leg. If this suture doesn't work, we may have to amputate Peppermint's leg. Truthfully, Peppermint, in about any dog, really does well on just three legs. There's no question about that. But the ideal is to get that leg healthy, and I think we have a much better chance of getting her adopted. This would be your shoulder blade up here. There's this big piece that's all fractured off here. I mean, ideally, we're just going to put an internal pin through here, put a wire, maybe two. I don't think we're going to get more than that because it's a small dog. We'll get this back in the position, wire that, and then an external pin with a bar. And that acts as a cast. It keeps it from rotating. It keeps it from moving while peppermint's healing. The scar tissue is really thick right there. Oh, I can't even get to the bone. It's just hard as a rock. The body wants to put this back together, and if it can't get bone to bone, it'll fill it in with fibroconnective tissue or scar tissue, essentially. It's incredibly strong, and it will hold things together well. I think I might be able to do something with this. The bones are in the right position. Uh, it's a matter of if we can wire them in and pin them in and keep them in that position. That's going to be the tricky part. Dr. Jeff has to drill a pin through Peppermint's leg to keep the pieces aligned so her bones can heal. Keep going. Stop. There. That looks really good, I think. So we have the bone perfectly. It looked really good aligned. We got one little wire around there. I got one pin high. I'm going to put one pin low, and we're going to set this up on a bar. This bar and stuff is space age technology. It's carbon fiber, it's really light, it's really super strong, stronger than steel. Basically like a, a metal rod cast, so bones can heal. I think I'm gonna stop here now. I need x-rays. It feels pretty good, but only an x-ray is gonna tell us how we really did. I need to go back and drive that IM pin in a little deeper and add some wire to keep the lower pieces of bone in place. The pin hasn't gone in deep enough to keep the bones from moving. Man, that sucks. That sucks. Well, it's not, it's not as right as I want it to be. 
Going back in on peppermint is definitely what's in the best interest for her. Dr. Jeff has been working on Peppermint's shattered leg for three hours. That is beautiful. The wire is around that piece. That's, man, that's beautiful looking. I really like the x-ray, OK? The, the wire is where it should be. So I really think it's going to heal. That is beautiful. That will work. That's what we need. Let's get out of this dog before it dies of old age. Right. Well, she's far from out of the woods. And just because we got this done doesn't mean she's going to walk. Peppermint's doing wonderful. She's recovering very well from her surgery. I'm glad we were able to save her leg. And she's just a happy-go-lucky dog. Cases like Peppermint's cost a lot of money for the clinic. We're barely breaking even at this point. A few weeks after her surgery, Peppermint. Peppermint is one step closer to a full recovery. Peppermint's here to get her pins out today. Bye, Peppermint. Be a good girl. Come on, sweetie. Pull the sutures, clean that up, and I'll put a size yeah. present. Peppermint had an older fracture with lots of pieces. And it was really tough to get that fracture lined up. And now, a little holiday miracle. We'll do a Christmas wrap on this. A family is interested in adopting the pup. I don't consider peppermint a Christmas gift. It just happened around Christmas time. The mere fact that the adopters of peppermint really wanted her and were willing to wait for us to make her right, I feel pretty good about it. That's the kind of stuff I got in business to do. Come here. Crazy? Peppermint has been to a heck of a lot. Abandoned with a broken leg, three-hour surgery, and she's been a trooper all the way along. And now she's going to end up in a really cool household. This is about as good as it gets. Oh. <laughs> she's so cute. Where do you think she'll like to sleep? In my bed. You think so? <laughs> yeah, in my bed. Who, here's the big question. Who's going to be charge of dog poop at Daddy. our house? <laughs> I knew that was going to be the answer. Yeah. <laughs> now that she has her forever family, it's so great that she can be here with us. We're so happy that yeah. Dr. Jeff got her all fixed, huh? Yeah, we yeah. are. Oh, yeah. oh so amazing. Oh,